He finally hit his limit, guys. He doesn't want no more. Well, well, well. I'm just, you know, coming out of this cave here in Minecraft, and I say that today we are going to force feed a villager. You know, villagers probably don't like to eat a lot. They're busy working most of the time, and they probably only eat what they need to, well, get by and continue their farming and going about their liveliness in a hole. But today we're going to, well, put a villager in captivity and force feed him an infinite amount of food, or try to at least. How's this going to work? I'm not quite sure, but I'm down to try it. Uh, I think it was a suggestion, so I was like, hey, Let's try it. You know, it could be funny. It could be weird. It could be scary. I don't know. W have you ever force fed a villager? What if he gets mad? What if he tries to kill us? What if he does kill us? I don't know. There's so many ways and, uh, or so many things that could go horribly wrong here. That's why I'm worried. So one like equals one villager spared uh, due to all of our wacky, crazy experiments. Uh, I'd like to say like one like spares a villager of uh, being a part of our science project. <laughs> Um, so yeah, if you want to save a villager, hit the like button. And if you want to suggest an experiment of your own that you would like us to do, like uh, have a villager skydive for 24 hours, I don't know how that would be possible, but you get my point, right? You get my point. Put your suggestions in the comment section below. Uh, today we're going to, well, we need a house. Maybe I could just find a village, Ooh, a witch hut. We could use the witch hut. Okay, I haven't seen a witch hut in forever. I don't know about you all, but for me, finding a witch hut is almost near impossible in Minecraft. So I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised that I found this. I'm not going to lie. Whoa. Okay, load up. I'm actually really surprised I found this. Oh my god, the witch has a black cat. Would you look at that? Hello there. I was wondering if I could use your house for an experiment. You seem to be quite the experimenter yourself with the potions that you brew. Uh -huh. uh, Okay, you actually genuinely just responded to me. That's actually kind of creepy. But what I am saying is, can I use your house? Yes or no? All you have to do is go, hmm, if you're okay with that. I know you speak a little bit. Different. Why is your nose moving like that? That is very odd. Guys, I'm going to be on. You're laughing. You, you thought that was a good joke about your nose? Yeah, usually witches don't like it when you insult their nose. But what I can say, can I use your house? Okay, pick wisely your decision. If you say no, I will have to murder you. If you don't say nothing at all, I will still have to murder you. I'm murdering this villager. All right, so let's get a sword. Or this villager? This witch, dude. Anyways. All right, goodbye. The cat has to go, too. The cat is contaminated with the evilness that is within. Anyways, uh, so yeah, that was weird interaction with the witch. I do apologize for that. Uh, but, okay, we're going to use the hut here, I suppose. What is going on here? I don't know. Uh, we're going to use this hut. And what we're going to do is basically just feed a villager till he, he, he he's stuffed. He doesn't want any more food. Now, you may be like, how do villagers eat? Well, villagers villagers really only like carrots, and that's really all they will pick up. They will only pick up carrots for our use. So, I just figure this is how we're going to do the force feed a villager. We're going to spawn him in here, and then we're going to give him, like, a million carrots. Mind you guys, I'm not using mods. I'm not doing anything. This is a 100% experiment here, okay? That's what I do on here. Like, it's 100%. There's no weird stuff attached to it. Uh, this If something happens, and that does, and if not, then we cry ourselves to sleep. So, um, let's go ahead and and remove all this just to get another layer down uh of the switch i kind of feel bad because like i said i never find witches huts so i'm just kind of like darn i don't want to destroy something like this so now we want to get a villager seed oh i feel sorry for this villager and we want a lot of carrots because for some reason villagers will only pick up carrots and will only consume carrots it's weird all right so hello you are a huh? Librarian, actually. The last villager that I expected to be our candidate here is a librarian. Oh well, he's going to have to do his part, and uh, hopefully, he does a good part in this. I am terribly sorry you had to be conducted in this, but either way, you signed away your rights. It ain't my problem. Uh, what do you mean he signed? He signed the paper, okay? Uh, anyways, let's go ahead and. Um, I think we're gonna need a farmer. No, we're not. He just he just devoured it. Look at it. Look at him. Oh my god. Look at it. Look at him go. I'm so care. Okay, that was actually 64 carrots. We know he has 64 carrots. How many is he going to eat? Look at him go. This is the weirdest thing I've ever done in Minecraft. What am I doing? 
There's probably people watching this right now like, you know, I clicked on this video because it seemed interesting. And I'm literally watching a man feed carrots to a villager. Ask yourself what you're doing. And I'll ask myself what I'm doing filming something like this. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we're, we're. it looks like we're going to have ended up giving him five stacks of carrots. Now, you ask yourself, well, if he's not eating them, what is... Is he getting bigger? Wait. He's eating all these carrots, and I think he's getting bigger. Let's throw this last stack here. Is he getting chunky? I don't know. Huh? You can get him a lantern. Now, here's the, here's the weird thing about this. His level is still right here. Is his level going up at all? Now, the curious thing I am about this is... Actually, will he accept bread, too? Oh my god, he will take bread. So, if he was going to just use all this for, like, trades or something, he, his trade would go up. He's literally eating this. Look at it, he's just... He's just eating it all. Alright, now what I want to see if it's... No, this isn't moving. You're literally eating all this. Sir, have you thought about a diet? You have a bottomless pit in your stomach. Yes. <laughs> that is so strange. Okay, so... This was a weird suggestion. I'm not gonna lie, guys. Uh, sitting here, I'm like, what am I doing? He appears to be eating the carrots. Now, I don't know if he has a limit. I thought maybe there's a limit, but we've already fed him over 60 carrots, and he's still going. He has no remorse either. He's like, you know, I'm eating everything. What is this? What, what can we learn from this? Do not drop your bread or carrots around a villager. They're gonna pick it up, they're gonna eat it, and they're not gonna give it back, okay? Till they poop it out. And um, it's a serious issue, so... I I don't know. I, I really don't know what to go from here. So, wait. He's done. He won't eat anymore. No, sir. You have to eat. This 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 is called force feeding a villager. Eat your, eat your veggies. Eat them. Eat them. Don't look at me. Eat them. Oh, he's at his limit. Oh, he finally hit his limit, guys. He doesn't want no more. Look at it. Eat it. <laughs> he doesn't want any more. He finally had enough. Okay. What about bread? You won't eat carrots no more. He won't eat he won't eat the bread either. Oh my god. We we've, we've he's finally full. Look at this. What if I hit him? Will you eat now? Sir, I'm gonna have to murder you if you do not eat this bread. Open your mouth. Eat it. Huh. He He's at his limit, guys. There's no more. <laughs> what? This is one of the weirdest... But, but whoa, whoa, Did he just eat it? Huh. No. This is one of the weirdest but most fun videos I've ever made. Seeing that I, he cannot eat no more. He's full. And we're like trying to force feed him here. You know what? I'm just going to leave all this bread here. Okay. If you want it, you can eat it. N no worries. Okay. It's kind of weird. It, there's a new mo movie about Hansel and Gretel coming out, I think. And like, we're in a witch hut. So it's kind of like, we're just, we're just getting this village prepared, right? <laughs> all right. Let's go ahead and get all that. Let's see what he does. We wait. As we come to the concluding factor of this video, guys, I have never in my life did anything weird like this. It is interesting. He is full. He will not eat no more. I don't know what that means, what's going on there. But this is a really, really interesting experiment to know that, yes, they will pick up your carrots and bread and eat them. It doesn't go towards their trade. They're literally eating these things, apparently. And on top of that, they do get full. They do have a limit. They won't eat no more after this set thing goes. Now, I'm not exactly sure what this means or entails. I'm not a Minecraft expert or genius, and I think my video 
videos really entail that. That's why I look at creepy pastas and stuff of Minecraft. I'm by no means a, a very knowledgeable person on Minecraft and it shows time and time again. But if you guys are, however, you can let me know in the comments section below something weird about this that I did not notice or why this is happening. Uh, and uh, also leave a suggestion for the next experiment because I'm learning a lot about doing this as well. Like I'm learning so much with each and every one of these videos that, uh, hey, you can force feed a villager. Uh, this is what happens when you give them too much bread and carrots. They hit their peak. They cannot eat no more. They're done. They want to break. It's really, really interesting. And and uh, yeah, so if anything, we learned a lot today. And if you haven't, hit the like button. And I will see you all in the next one.